In its simplest terms, a project's origin point is simply a three-dimensional spot in space. In other words, it could be a corner of the building. It could be the edge of the site. It could be a corner of the parking lot. It could even be the middle of a tree. The idea of the project origin point is it's a common point that everybody who's working on the project knows and can recognize. Why you want a project origin point is so that if someone else is working on the project in their office, potentially even in another software program, when it comes time to line their work up with your work, all they have to do is insert the project and then their work will automatically line up with yours, or vice versa. And that can occur if you both share the same project origin point. To set the project origin point, you'll find that underneath the Manage tab, over here, there's an option for Project Location. Currently, it's grayed out because we're in a 3D view inside of the Revit Advanced Project file. But we can get this to not be grayed out by coming underneath Floor Plans under the Project Browser and double-clicking on the word Site. This opens up the Site Plan view, and we can start to specify a project origin point. Now, come up here underneath Project Location again under the Manage tab and select on Coordinates. Come down on the list and choose Specify Coordinates at Point. This will allow you to specify where that project origin point should be at. Zoom into a common corner of the building, pick that point, and then tell it that that spot in three-dimensional space is located wherever it is that you type. In this instance, I'm going to tell it it's at zero, zero, and I'll give it an elevation of 12,000. From here, if I would click on OK, that will be the new coordinates at that point. Another way that you could get these coordinates is if they've already done the drawings for the site plan, and they'll tell you what those coordinates should be. Then it's a simple matter of coming in, specifying the coordinates at point, typing the correct information, and then selecting OK in order to specify that as being the origin point of your project. So, the origin point of a project, it's used to be able to line up all the different project data for all the different project teams that might be involved in that project.